What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at NG Models August 2021 releases. Without further ado, let's get started. Starting off here, we have a Skymark 737-800. Uh, this is uh, apparently a Pokemon livery. I think Skymark is a Japanese airline, I want to say, based on the registration, which is Juliet Alpha 73 Alpha Bravo. Uh, but yeah, this is in the Pokemon livery. Of course, I don't need it. I don't collect any Asian models, nor do I think I will ever. I will. I, I do collect Asian models, but not the narrow body type. But uh, yeah, I don't need this. Uh, and the price is forty seven ninety nine, and it's scale one to four hundred. Now, all of these models in this release are one to four hundred. So uh, yeah. Anywho, moving on down the line, we have this Delta seven three seven nine hundred ER. This looks pretty nice. Um, I'm probably going to get this model. I'm probably going to get it because Delta do fly their 737-900s to Newark. Um, so basically, during the off-season, so usually between the months of October and usually March or April, they fly the 737-800s uh, from Atlanta to Newark, and then um, they fly their 737-900ERs from Salt Lake City year-round to Newark, and then... Uh, during the popular seasons to fly to Atlanta from Newark, this is when they use their 737-900. So I'm definitely going to get this one, or I definitely need this one, because um, they fly to two destinations using this model. But uh, yeah, registration is November 913 Delta Uniform and 913DU. It's scale 1 to 400, and the price is forty six ninety nine. Moving on down the line, we have this Japan Airlines 77-9 Dreamliner. Uh, it looks pretty nice. Of course, I don't need the model. The registration is Juliet Alpha 863 Juliet, JA 863J. And it's scale 1 to 400, and the price is $55.99. Moving on down the line, we have um, this Air Canada uh, 787 Dreamliner. This is in their new livery, and it's in the Fly the Flag Go Canada Go uh, livery. Now... NG Models, they called this release, I think, an Olympic release or something like that. Uh, they called it that because basically um, they had a lot of Olympic-ish liveries. Because the reason why it says fly the flag in this one is because um, I believe it's supposed to refer to the Olympics as in like flying the Canadian flag. But uh, yeah, registration is Charlie, Foxtrot, Victor, Lemur, Lim Lemur? Lima, Quebec. Uh, it's scale 1 to 400 and the price is $55.99. Moving on down the line, we have another Air Canada 787-9 Dreamliner. This one is in the normal livery. Uh, I don't need it for Newark, nor do I need any Air Canada 787s for Newark. But uh, yeah, uh, registration for this one is Charlie Foxtrot Romeo, I want to believe. Yeah, Romeo Tango Golf. It's scale 1 to 400, and the price is $55.99. Moving on down the line, we have a Hawaiian 787-9 Dreamliner. I don't need this one for Newark, but it does look pretty nice. I know this is going to be very good for those of you who do... Honolulu International Airport, especially those such as Mile High Aviation, but uh, yeah, this is, the registration on this model is November 780, uh, Hotel Alpha N780HA, it's scale 1 to 400, and the price is $55.99. Moving on down the line, we have two Turkish AT3200s. Starting off here, we have a Turkish Airlines AT3200, this is in their Turkey Olympic livery, I think it is. Um, this is actually, I'm actually quite sad by the series because i actually need turkish i need a turkish ac 3300 for newark because they actually started service to newark back in june i believe it was june 29th they started service to newark daily service to istanbul and i'm kind of sad because this is a 8300 i need the 8300 you know but um yeah i don't need this model uh registration is uh, Tango Charlie Juliet November Bravo. It is scale one to four hundred, and the price is fifty five ninety nine. Moving on down the line, we have a regular Turkish AT thirty two hundred. Once again, I don't need this for Newark, but if they do ever release a Turkish AT thirty three hundred, I will be the first one to get it. But uh, yeah, registration on this one is uh, Tango Charlie Juliet November Echo. It is scale one to four hundred, and the price is fifty five ninety nine. Moving on down the line, we have an SAS A350-900, and I'm just, I'm really happy right now because I've been waiting for a model company to release an SAS A350 for so long. I, I was actually thinking of going onto eBay and buying a used one, a used either JC Wings Phoenix 
or Gemini Jet Swarm, and finally, NG Models has decided to come through and release it. And this is actually the same registration model that flies to Newark, so this is this is perfect. Um, SAS, uh, not SAS, NG Models have once again made my day. Uh, this one I have to get. This one's uh, the registration on this one is Sierra Echo Romeo Sierra Bravo SERSB. It's scale one to four hundred, and the price is fifty seven ninety nine, and it's named Hagbard Viking. Here we have two Lufthansa A350 900s. Now, I I said in a previous video, I don't know which one it was, that I needed a Lufthansa A350 900. This is no longer the case, um, as you guys will see in next week's August 2021 airport update. Um, I'll put a card up uh, now so you guys can see uh, the airport update. But uh, I actually got a Lufthansa A350 by trading a friend, my SAS A330. I got a Lufthansa A350 and United Eco Skies. You guys will see both of those models in uh, the August 2021 airport update. So um, I'm kind of sad that I have the Gemini Jets one, but then again, I don't have to spend more money on a model. So yeah, this is the Lufthansa NU A350 900. Uh, registration is Delta Alpha India X Ray Papa D A. AIXP. It is scale 1 to 400 and the price is $57.99. Moving on down the line to the last model of this release, we have this Lufthansa A350 900. This is in their uh, new livery. Registration is Delta Alpha India X ray Quebec. This is actually the same one that flies to Newark and it might actually be flying on this one because in eight days from now, I believe, I'm going to be flying. Uh, to Europe on Lufthansa A350 and CRJ900, so this might actually be the aircraft that I'm flying to Europe, which is kind of exciting. Uh, but uh, yeah, registration is uh, Delta Alpha India X Ray Quebec, as I said before. It is scale 1 to 400, and the price is $57.99. Now, the models that I would get from this release probably would be the Delta 737-900ER. SAS A350-900, those are really the only two models that I need from this release, but uh, yeah, that being said, that does conclude this video, if you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, turn on notification bosses for my videos, and comment down below what you're getting from this release, for me, this is a pretty exciting release, once again, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video, as always, goodbye.